last commercial flight of this aircraft. After uh, this flight, it's going to be flying out to New Mexico for the uh, rest of its uh, lifetime. They may chop this up. No making me cry on the camera, but yes, I, I know that. Hopefully it makes it one more. They were saying 41,000 times it's been in the air. It's pretty crazy. How old are you? You may be younger than, the, you're 23? Yeah, I'm younger than the plane, right? They're retiring them to the desert. It'll either be chopped up, sold. Wow, I thought that they were talking about the pilot, not the plane. You sit back, relax, enjoy your flight. The night sky over Chicago. The end of the final commercial flight for this jetliner. Tomorrow, though, I'll have the plane all to myself as the American jetliner is ferried to an aviation boneyard in New Mexico. The best thing about this plane ride, there were no other passengers and a great chance to finally vent. Hey, thanks for leaning your seat back without warning. Can you get that baby to stop crying? Stop kicking my seat. I wanted it to be a nice landing. I wanted it to be something everyone could remember. I wanted to to enjoy it. We just shut down the motors and parked the brakes and it's it's hitting me. Affectionately we do call it the boneyard. For me it's like a big uh, aircraft enthusiast playground. Strolling in the boneyard is a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Massive jetliners that roam the skies, now awaiting a depressing fate. You can tell just from uh, different states of the aircraft, you know, which ones have been heavily harvested. I've always wanted to stand under a 747, right? That's right. But this one's not moving. It will never move. Not under its own power ever again. How many planes that have been retired are on this field? Um, on the books right now, we have 103 for American, and probably there's another 100 out here from the past that are no longer on our books. Step up. Oh, I'm afraid I'm going to fall through the plane. All right, let's check out the cockpit. If I reach for this throttle, I'm not going to get a pull-up, pull-up warning that you hear on all these cockpit tapes. <laughs> not today, you're not going to. I finally got out that window seat I've been <laughs> looking for. <laughs> you didn't get put in the middle. Probably within the next month, this plane will be crunched up, put in a truck, and hauled off to a smelter. That's, that's its fate. The American Airlines jet I flew in on sits with other new arrivals. It will likely be stripped to its bones for spare parts, or worse, the crusher. could go through anything. Today is actually my first one that I've actually got a crush. Will you always remember your first crush? It's kind of like being in a relationship. You always remember the first one. 